In this video, I'm going to show you how you can create a faucet for ERC20 token with Solidity. And before we continue, make sure that you join the Facebook group of Eat the Blocks where you will find me and all the students and you can ask all your questions about blockchain development and how to find your first blockchain job. So if you develop smart contract before, you probably use faucet, like the Robsten faucet. Basically, faucet allow you to get some fake token for free so that you can use it, use them on public test net. And the thing is, when you do local development on your computer and there is an ERC20 token involved, you might also need to get some free fake ERC20 token so that you can play around, run your test, so is there a way to build a faucet locally for any ERC20 token? Yes, and I'm gonna show you this. So here I am in Remix, and I'm gonna create a new smart contract for my ERC20 token, mytoken.sol. So this is gonna be with the current version of Solidity 0.6.0. And I'm going to import the ERC20 token of Open Zeppelin, Open Zeppelin, which is a very famous Solidity library. If you need the refresher on that, I actually have a full series on my YouTube channel. So here I'm on the homepage of Open Zeppelin. Then I go in the folder contract repo inside token ERC20. I click on ERC20 here. That's what I want. Then I'm going to copy paste the URL back to Remix. I'm going to import all of that. Okay. Uh, by the way, I'm showing you this example in Remix, so here I can import a, a URL, but if you are doing this with Truffle, you will need to replace this URL by a reference to the NPM package of OpenZeppelin. Um, and after that, I'm going to define my token. So my token, I inherit from ERC20. And I'm going to create a constructor to instantiate my contract. So constructor. And it's going to take two arguments. First, the name of the token, string memory name. And second, I forgot the second argument. Oh, let me see. In the smart contract of Open Zeppelin, let's scroll down. So here in the constructor, it needs the name and the symbol. Both are strings. Okay. So string memory symbol. And after that, we're gonna forward this argument to the constructor of ERC20 that way. Uh, we make that public, and we don't need any body definition okay so here we have an ers20 and now we want to add the faucet functionality so that anybody is able to get some free yes some free token and play with it so we're going to create this function and we're going to call this um i don't know uh, mint for example you could call it a uh, faucet also if you want uh, it's going to take two arguments. The first one is the recipient address. So address recipient. And second one would be the amount of token that you want to send. Okay, I'll make it external. And after, we're going to use a function defined by the ERC20 token of OpenZeppelin. So let's go here. In the source code, let's scroll down until we see underscore mint. Here, it takes two arguments, the address and the amount. Okay, let me copy this. Back to our contract, let me paste this. So first we'll have our recipient. And then the amount. And that's it. So here this main function is going to create our token and send them to the recipient. And you might wonder, well, where do these tokens come from? It's just created out of nowhere. Yes, exactly. Created out of nowhere. Exactly like the feds who just injected 
trillions of dollars created out of nowhere. This is exactly the same. You can also be the Federal Reserve on the blockchain. And so after, how would you use this mean function? Well, most likely in your truffle project, in your migration file, when you deploy my token, probably you will call mint for different addresses. So you distribute enough token to different addresses and after you can run tests or you can deploy a decentralized application and on the front end, you can play with all these tokens that you are distributed. You can do whatever you want. And if you are happy with this trick and you want to know even more tricks with Solidity, you can check out this series with many other really cool tricks. I'll see you there. Bye bye.